catch my breath Living life as if we had a choice Hi guys, welcome back to another video and in today's video I'm going to show you my trip to Singapore, the hotel tour, uh, Universal Studios Singapore and how actually I got broke in Singapore. So let's jump right in. We are leaving from Singapore today and going to Thailand and today everybody left us at the outside area and visited gardens by the bay because we weren't able to even walk up till there we all are ill including simon singapore made us ill so we are off for uh, singapore now looking really messed up we woke up at around 6 30 and we have a flight of i guess 11 because the airport is really far from the hotel and from Kuala Lumpur so that's the feedback of the restroom Simon what do you think what did you do Simon very poor <laughs> Simon that's bad it's good the outside area and Malaysia are so green peaceful Simon it's too zoomed in with no makeup on <laughs> so uh, the best part of uh, the place is that it has uh, 7 Eleven nearby and my family and myself we love 7 Elevens be it Thailand be it Singapore be it Malaysia we love 7 Eleven store and if you are one of us, uh, leave me comments down below. Let's give them a round of the thing. That's the room and that's the view. And that's me with Parda Hello. <laughs> so guys, while at Singapore, I have come to a checklist uh, which you should be going through if you are planning to go to Singapore. So point number one is that guys, it is hell expensive. People think it's not but it's very 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 expensive. Second thing, you should never buy sim for singapore from india you should always go and buy a sim uh, from singapore airport which is much cheaper i guess i had used a 900 to 800 inr over there and i got 100 gb data for one month and 30 minutes calling to india free and uh, normal calling free so that is an amazing deal i feel so you should do that third thing i guess is that water over there is also very expensive guys so what you should do is that you should never buy packaged water over there i just got to know after staying for one day over there and and spending money on water on water all the water uh, which is in singapore uh, whether it is in the washroom or it is in the kitchen or it is for washing or it is for whatever is sterilized it's filtered and fit for drinking so don't waste your money uh, buying packaged water just go and uh, get the water from anywhere you want and drink that so that will save you a lot of money and thank me later so I guess that's it so uh, I hope this checklist will surely help you guys and let's enjoy the rest of the vlog try to hold the breath you've taken that last it's getting cold getting Getting cold A seething in my chest You give me no rest It's getting old, getting old, getting old Getting old, getting old. <laughs> 
Chaman, how did you enjoy outside sea lobby? अरे मजा है पापा के साथ बातें कर बातें बात तो seriously So one thing which we absolutely loved about the Singapore airport was that the immigration was not manual and it it was automatic through machines and which saved a lot of time for us. We are buying a gift for Tuba from the Charles and Key. Tuba, you decide and then buy. Buy a cheaper one. Have less money. Need to shop more. Thing right here is the check-in thing, and I find it really cute. And while I was saying that, I was telling that to Mama, the operator over there thought that, yeah, so operator there over uh, thought that I'm talking about he being cute, which I wasn't. I got the Glock in my robbery, 17 shots, no 38, yeah, I got the Glock in my robbery. 